Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Excuse the towel on my head. It's been a rough morning. So let me explain what this video is going to be. So today I am meeting my best friend's boyfriend for the first time ever. Basically, you guys know my best friend Renee. So Renee and I have been friends since high school. You know, now that I'm a college girl, it's been since high school, the good old days. And she goes to American University and there, she found a boyfriend. She found a <laughs> Obviously, I've seen him over FaceTime and stuff like that, but I have never met this man, okay? I have never seen them together. I have never seen them interact. I am so excited to see. I want to see, like, their dynamic, how they work, if he gets my stamp of approval. Um, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> I even want to see what they look like together because I've literally only seen like their heads on FaceTime And it's so interesting because I had a boyfriend like Most of high school and then now Renee has a boyfriend and I'm single so well 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 How the turntables You good? No, you're not you're not baby and it's okay. You're not good and it's okay. <laughs> Okay, so basically what we're doing today, what the plan is, they're coming up from American and I'm gonna meet them there and we're just gonna see everything. This is the first time that her parents are meeting him. So I'm so, so excited. But I'm also, most importantly, so excited to see Renee because I have not seen her in so long. Yeah, my skin is literally looking so much better and it looks so red on camera, so that's just really great. Cause literally looking at it in the mirror, it's like not even that red. Honestly, So for skin, I can't tell if I want to put on BB cream or just put on a little bit of concealer because my skin really is not that bad and I kind of, I hate the feeling of makeup so heavy when you have a mask on, like it's just so annoying and unenjoyable. So I'm just going to kind of spot conceal. I've realized though guys, my acne is not even that bad. I'm actually not going to call it acne because I'm not giving it any power over me anymore and I'm not going to let it take a place in my life. But it's really not that bad. It's really just scarring now. But my dermatologist said that he can do a treatment on my skin. So he can either do like lasering or take blood from my arm and resurface my skin. So there's like a lot of options that I can do. I'll definitely, if I do any of them, take you guys along so that you guys can see for yourself as I put concealer all over my face. <laughs> But yeah, there does seem like there's a lot of other options that I can do now because I don't really think that my skin is that bad anymore, which is so exciting. I think because my scars look so much like acne, I always think that my skin is just breaking out so bad. Um, but then like when I'm actually feeling it, I'm like, wait, it's literally not that bad. So that does make me feel a lot better because... I don't know if any of you guys have acne, but struggling with acne for literally years, it's exhausting. It's on your face, so it's so hard, Because, but I think that I do have sensitive skin, so I think that when I kind of have any type of like breakout, it really scars very easily, which is annoying, but it is what it is. I don't even think I'm an insecure person, but I do think that that's my biggest insecurity. Now I'm just setting my skin with some NARS translucent powder. This powder... I used it all the time when I was in high school, like a freshman, because when I was a freshman, my skin was perfect. Like, my skin was literally absolutely flawless. I try not to put on too much skin makeup, as I said, just because, like, with the mask, it does get, like, to be annoying. Ugh, do I even want to fill my eyebrows? No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, I think that I'm just going to put a little bit of, like, liner on with my eyeshadow. Exciting news guys, I put down my housing deposit for next year. So get ready for some college vlogs, dorm tours, move-in vlogs. Subscribe if you guys want to see any of that content because that is coming. So with the eyeliner, I do it with eyeshadow and then I take a little pencil brush, I think that's what it's called, and then just like blend it. Yeah, then it looks like cute and natural, kind of, sort of, in a way. So I stole this gel from my dad because he had two of them, and I said, sir, I am going to need to steal one of those. I take it, I put a little spoolie in here, rub it around a little, get some gel on it, and then like brush it off because you don't want it to be too much. 
and then I already brushed my eyebrows how I want them to be but then I'll literally just take the gel and then I'll like do them really fluffy because I really like that look um, and then I'll take another spoolie and like brush them out again so that they're not like chunky gel they're just like gelled my eyebrows get so long it's like not even funny then mascara I like to use the mineral fusion Mascara, I have been putting on a lash serum. I'll tell you which one it is. The Natural Plus Eyelash Serum. It looks like this. Okay, it's this one. It looks like this. And yeah, it literally, I think, is working so well on my eyelashes. And now my last step is going to be some highlighter. Put some on our brow bone. So I use the lip liner, the NYX Natural Lip Pencil. It's darker than your natural lip color, but it still looks really good. Well, my natural lip color. Perfect pout. It's just really light and natural and pretty. Okay guys, so I'm going to blow dry my hair really quick off camera in my mom's room and then I'm gonna come back in here because I think I'm gonna straighten my hair. So that is what we're gonna do and I'll be back. Okay guys, so a little plot twist. I'm actually not gonna straighten my hair. I'm gonna curl my hair. So I have about 15 minutes. So let's hope that I can get this done in that time i'm gonna give you guys a little tutorial okay because we're really getting ready together today i like to section it off like this the bottom part is getting long oh my god it's so exciting just take like say this a one inch section take it down leave some hair out to keep it very loose let it heat up yada 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 i have been drinking a cup of green tea every single day because i hear it can help clear up your skin this is the important part when you take out your hair you're gonna unwind it, unwind it, and then pull this section like that to kind of straighten it. So that's how you get that loose beachy wave um, instead of like a really tight, tight curl. So do the same thing to your whole head. And I alternate going towards and away my face. You always want your front pieces to be away from your face to look more flattering, but everything else you can go towards away, towards away, towards away, towards away. Alexa, play pop station. Alexa, skip song. Alexa, off. Alexa, play Thank You Next album by Ariana Grande. Their hair is all curled. Wow, it looks good today, actually. I think I'm gonna wear my Fila's today. Okay, guys, so I'm wearing this black shirt from literally TJ Maxx and then these snakeskin pants from <laughs> my mom. <laughs> she gave them to me, so. Grab my lip supplies. Okay, guys. Okay, we are in the car now. All right, so, guys. Oh, I look so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna drive and then I'll talk to you guys when I get there. Okay, guys. So, Hi, everyone. <laughs> I'm with Renee. We have met the boyfriend, okay? I have met Liam. Okay, well, enter picture here. Enter <laughs> picture here. A doll. Very nice. He's gotten my stamp of approval, which is oh, hard to God. come by. No, I'm just kidding. And also, by the way, we're. I'm not wearing a mask because I'm fully vaccinated and also she is halfway vaccinated. Yeah, and also they're all like family and everything and I'm obviously not right. and blood. She, she ate outside, it was it was all very safe, all socially distanced. Um, Liam's negative, so we're all very being safe. safe. Disclaimer. Yeah, this is the first time he met her parents. It was very <laughs> nerve wracking, I was very nervous. Review. Um, he's meshing in really well. My parents seem to like him a lot. Their the conversation is flowing. It is, I would say it's flowing. Um, and also, I'm just so excited to see Paige. I haven't seen her in a That was the best part of all this. My I'm parents love Paige too, so they were just them. as excited to see me as they were Paige. <laughs> I, I can guarantee you that. So. Stop it, you're making me blush. <laughs> all right, bye guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe, love y'all.